Hello everyone, in this video let's discuss about the splay tree deletion. So splay tree insertion video link is given in description, you can assess it. After seeing this video, you will be confirmed to solve any problem which will be related to splay tree deletion. Okay, they have told to delete 12, 14 and 16 from a given tree. So where is 14? 14 is in the root node and 16 is the right side of it and 12 is the leaf node. Leaf node means the node which will be having zero number of child that is no child. This 12 is not having any child so we will call it as the leaf node. So while deleting the nodes in this play tree there will be three cases. The first case is to delete the delete node with delete node with zero child. Delete the node with zero child. Zero child means that is to delete the leaf node. So what will be the condition? Just simply delete. Simply delete. Now what will be the second case? To delete node with one child. Node with one child. That may be right child or left child. The node with one child will be deleted by swapping with by swapping with its child node its child node what we will do if it is having only one child that is for example if it is 10 so 10 is having only one child that is 12 what I will do I will swap it with the its child that is 10 12 will go to 10 plus and 10 will come to 12 plus so therefore what will 10 happen 10 will be the node with the zero child so we can delete easily so then after swapping it with its child directly delete directly delete now the third condition is to delete the node with two child so the node child with so to delete the node with two, two child for example 16 it is having left child also right child also we will be having two condition the first condition is using in order predecessor in order predecessor and another one will be using in order successor one will be using in order predecessor and another one will be in order successor what is in order predecessor and in order successor we will be discussing while solving this problem now first what they have told delete 12 I must delete 12 now so where is 12 12 is in the leaf so leaf means 0 child 0 child means simply delete 12 so after deleting what will be my tree 14 13 will be same 16 will be same 15 17 7 and 10 because I deleted 12 directly now what I should do is I must make the parent of the deleted node. So who is the parent of the deleted node? That is 10. I must make 10 as the root node. That is this playing operation. What we should do? After deleting the node we want to delete, we must make the parent of that node as the root node. Now I must bring, bring 10 towards 14. I must bring 10 to 14. What I will be doing? Just you see, 14 will be as it is. I must bring 10 upside towards the root by shifting one one position itself. So see, 14, 13 will be same, 16 will be same, 15 will be same and 17 will be same. Now what I will do, I will shift one level upside. I will shift 10 one level upside. So that is 10 will be coming here. So 10 is less than 13. So I wrote left side. Now which element I replaced? 7. So I will compare 7 with 10. So 7 is less than 10. So I will write to the left. Now the, my parent node is here. I must make it as the root node. What I will do? I will shift to the next level. We must shift level by level. 14 will be same. 16 will be same. 15 will be same. 17 will be same. 
so this will be called as the zig operation zigzag operation like and all i don't want to confuse you so i said so i said just shift one one level upside now i am shifting the 10 to one level up now my left out elements are 13 and 7 first from downside to upside which is the first one that is 7 compare 7 with 10 so 7 is less than 10 next 13 so 13 is greater than 10 now my 10 that is parent node has came here i must make it as root at the next step i will replace it with the 14 so 10 had came here now at the last step when i made this parent node as root node i must consider all the elements and then i must do this playing operation what i will do if you compare 14 is greater than 10 14 next then 7 so 7 is less than 10 so 7 will come to the left next 13 so 13 is greater than 10 but less than 14 so 13 will come here next 16 so 14 is connected to 16 so connect 16 itself now 15 so 15 is less than 16 and 17 is greater than 16 now i made the parent of the node i deleted as the root node now my operations is done so after deleting the node you must make its parent as the root node now i must delete 14 so i must delete 14 how you will delete 14 means take the same question 14 so 14 is in the root node i must delete it so it is having two child 13 is one child 16 is one child so to delete the node with the two child we can use in order predecessor or in order successor what is in order predecessor means you will be you will be seeing the left side of the root that is the you will be seeing the left subtree of the node you must delete I must delete 14 I will see the left side so this full will be the left subtree and this full will be the right subtree in left subtree which is the value that will be greater I will replace it with it or else in the right hand side that is the right tree in the right subtree I will replace 14 with the smallest element so let's consider the successor itself that is replace node that you want to delete with the smallest element smallest element at the right subtree at the right subtree in the right subtree smallest element will be replaced with the node i want to delete i want to delete 14 and the smallest of the right subtree is 15 so 15 will go to the 14th place and 14 will come to the 15th place therefore when 14 comes to 15th place it will be the leaf node how to delete the leaf node directly delete so after the deletion of the 14 what will be my tree so if you see after deleting 14 my tree will be so on 14 place 15 will be going because i used in order successor and it will be 13 7 10 12 next 16 17 so here i took the 14 and 15 were replaced so 14 came here it became the leaf node and directly it was deleted since i deleted the 14 and it is the root node it is not having any parent node there is no splaying operations will be performed on this if there was any parent node i must make it as the root node since for 14 there is no parent node there is no need of making it as the parent node there is no need of making it as the root node now the last is delete 16 so 16 is also having the two childs 15 and 17 now this will be the left subtree for 16 this will be the right subtree for 16 since we are having only one one element in both you can delete by replacing 16 with 15 or you can replace 16 with 17 and delete it now let's consider after deleting 16 so i will be replacing it with the 15 and then i will delete so 14 13 will be same 7 will be same and 10 will be same and 12 will be same 
Now I replaced 16 with 15. 15 will be going here and 16 will be coming here. So I will be deleting directly and 17 will be here itself. Now which node I deleted? I deleted 16. I must make its parents as root node. Its parent is 14 and it is already a root node. There is no there is no need of making it again the root node. So what you should do first you must delete. Then you must make the parent of that node which you deleted as the root node. So simple technique. So you can use the in order successor which will be easy. Just see the right subtree of the node having two child. In the right subtree, whichever the smaller number will be there, replace it with it. Then the number will be coming to as a leaf node and then directly delete and make its parent as the root node. Hope you understood the concept of this play tree deletion. If you like the video, please comment below and please subscribe and support us. Thank you.